so I literally just sat here with a rock against my mouse to grind all this copper and the handle broke. <laughs> um, yes, the handle will break if you are if you try to grind it and there's nothing in it. So this is all the copper ore I had. Um, unfortunately, that's not quite enough. Now I do have 25 ingots that I got from all the dungeon places I've looted. Um, but again, <laughs> that's not enough. So I'm kind of... What else makes this? Malachite... That's that's copper. Just I haven't seen any. Oh wait, have I? No, I haven't seen any of this ore. And it sucks. Ah, uh, because I need three stacks, so I can turn that back into dust. I need three stacks of the damn stuff. Okay, slept again. Let's, uh... uh yeah, there's a bit of an invasion over the night. <laughs> all right, hold on. Let's get all this... Let's get all this taken care of. Let's get... I don't need anything. All right. I need... Well, no, I, I do need... I, I do need torches. I could just hear the the villagers suffering outside. Oh no! <laughs> I need like a bunch of torches. There we go, and boom! Tired of running out of torches. All right, so I am back on the hunt for copper, and then hopefully we can continue with our with our progress yep so let me go find some copper real quick and I'll be right back with you guys okay I think I've got enough copper now I only found a few I found eight and I actually found one of that uh, that weird green ore that turns into copper so not too shabby um, now as I get back out of this cave it actually wasn't that far from the village, and uh, I labeled it coal mine because, as you can see, it has like a metric crap ton of coal. <laughs> um, so let's get back out of this, uh, and I'll continue my discussion <laughs> about mod integration, uh, bronze, steel, etc. Once I figure out how to get back out of here. Um, so the reason why. The, and this this ties into what we're doing. So the reason why we're we're having to get so much copper is to make so much so much bronze because the way where's my horse? Because the way Greg Tech is set up, there he is. The way Greg Tech is set up, it is, since it pushes all of the industrial craft machines, what would normally be made with iron, pushes it into steel. It creates a um, like. Ooh, a bronze uh, tier, uh, like an introductory level, and it's it's actually steam based um, instead of electric based. Um, and in Greg Tech, there's basically uh, there's bronze versions of all the of all the basic Greg Tech machines that you'll be making. I'm gonna take a damage from. We oh shit. <laughs> There's the village over there. Uh, you can do it, horse. I believe in you. <laughs> um, but here's the thing. If you have some of those other mods that I was telling you about, um, so if you have, you know, if you have a way to get steel uh, outside of Greg Tech, really the only bronze machine in Greg Tech you need to make is the uh, bronze version of an alloy smelter um, because <clears throat> because Greg Tech hijacks the circuit recipes, which I think I can show you here. Um, so on the basic circuit, it requires a red alloy plate. 
to make red alloy plate, you need red alloy ingots. To make the red alloy ingots, you need an alloy smelter, which is copper ingot and redstone. Um, and the reason why I say that is because to make a... Oh, I typed in gen. I'm not sure I should have typed in gen. There we go. Um, yeah, trying to find generator is impossible. So, to make a... Um, oh, that's right. Uh, what is it? Is it battery I'm thinking of? Hold on. Casing. No, what am I? What's the path I'm going down here? <laughs> well, for starters, you need steel plates. I think. I don't know. Anyway, in order to make a circuit, you need you need the alloy smelter. Oh crap. So that's really the only thing you need. I'm, it's been a while since I played Greg Tech. Oh, poor guy. <laughs> All right, so we should finally have enough stuff. So let me get back to cranking. All right, so we've got that all that all crushed together. So we've just need a bit, just a bit more. Bloop bloop bloop. Um. Basically, we need. Oh no! Wait, hold on, hold on. I'm doing. I'm doing something stupid. I actually need to cook this in order to get credit for the quest. Yeah, because it's looking for ingots. Um, let's see. I've got two more furnaces, fortunately. Uh, and I think I have enough iron. Oh no! It takes iron plates, doesn't it? Hmm. Or does it? I think it does. But let's. Yeah, it does. <clears throat> Come here, iron. I need you. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, wait. Am I using... Crap. Oh, no. I wanted to use the iron one. I need ten of those, I think. If, if I don't, I'll need more at some point. Oops, there we go. And boom. Alright. We have three iron furni. Bloop. Uh, we also have more coal. We can put in here. There we go. A nice a nice even amount. <laughs> Alright, so we'll go ahead and cook it all. Oops, that's not what I wanted. So, all three stacks. Alright, and while that's cooking, we can actually get cranking on the tin. Um, I don't want to go ahead and just do all of the tin. Let's see, that's tin. What else breaks down into tin? <laughs> There's a lot of this gypsum. I don't know what it becomes gypsum ore. Um, what does this yellow stuff turn into? It turns into iron. This turns into tin, I think. And I actually have found a lot of that. Um, right. Bloop, bloop, bloop. What? Aw. Oh, well. <laughs> I, I, I've got plenty. All right, so sorry for all the cuts. Uh, but it's pretty much necessary with Greg Tech. So, see you guys in a minute. We'll be hopefully wrapping up the episode here soon. Alright. Alright. The copper is done cooking. I've got the tin all grinded up and uh, and cooking at the moment. My rubber tree grew. So, uh, went ahead and collected the the resin and the rubber. And I, I got two saplings out of it. So, they are they're replanted. Um, now, I do think I've actually got enough... Tin. Now, um, well, no, I need a stack of tin. Oh, oh, come on, four more, four more. Now there is something I'm a bit concerned about because 
it's one of those quests that wants you to manually detect it, and I'm afraid it's going to actually consume the copper and tin. I hope it didn't. Okay, please tell me my stuff's still there. Okay, phew. That would have been a lot of stuff gone. I know there are some quests that, that eat the resources. Okay, so, uh, man, we're almost done with this getting started thing. All right, so... We did the ingot quest. Uh, still working on that. Now we need... Oh! It's already given me... Oh, it gave me credit for the copper dust, but not the tin dust. I've got to turn it back into dust. <laughs> no. Pew! Oh. Oh, cool. Wait, how do you make the, the mortar thing? Mortar... Just iron, iron, stone, oops, uh, iron, iron, and stone brick. Uh, we'll go ahead and make more than one, I guess. Okay, and final bit. There we go. You detect it now? Right. How is bronze dust completed? What? What? Hold on. <laughs> How is that completed? I don't I don't have bronze dust. Okay. Well, we have somehow completed the bronze dust quest without actually making bronze dust. Um, so now we just need three stacks of bronze ingots. Which I'll get some tin here and I'll show you why this is gonna hurt. And I may not do this. I may I may make I may change this. Because I honestly don't agree. I don't agree with this. So, let's... Pew, pew. Um, oh, do you have to do it with the dust? Oh. oh, hold on. Let me turn some of this back in the dust. I may have to do it with the dust. Okay, let's turn some of it back in the dust. Dang it. Spread! <laughs> there we go. Um, oh, it makes three bronze dust. Okay. Hmm. Maybe it's a future version I'm thinking of. Okay, so this doesn't, this doesn't hurt as, as much. Let's, let's go ahead and do it. Let's go ahead and do it real quick. So we need, boom, and boom. Crap. And we need more of these. <laughs> One, two, yeah, there we go. Uh, is that... No, we need two more. Alright. Now, finally, we can combine these together. By our, cap by our powers combined, I am Captain Bronze. And there we go. Three stacks of bronze. That should... Oh, I need to smelt it. Ah! <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, bronze is all cooked. We can complete this quest and enter the Bronze Age. Da 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 da. -da. So now the only quest we have left on the getting started is the stupid rubber tree quest, which we'll complete that eventually. I mean, we have to. We, we have to get a rubber tree farm going, um, especially since, again, going back to mod, uh, I forgot the word now, uh, integration, interaction, um, since we don't have Mine Factory Reloaded, uh, Mine Factory Reloaded rubber trees are a lot more common and a lot more easy to find, uh, but we don't have that, we just have the industrial craft rubber trees, so yeah, we've entered the Bronze Age, um, now why... Does it not want you to make a chest plate? That's very bizarre. <laughs> it's very weird. I guess it must have something to do with this. So it looks like we're going to start going down this this chain of... Um, see, this is a, a Railcraft water tank, which, like, as I said, all this stuff is steam-based. So this is... I think that's a steam boiler. Um, and that's, you know, ultimately how you get to steel... Um, at least how you get to steal through this versus 
doing it another way. Actually, before we go, I want to make sure I can even do this the Railcraft way. Um, oh yeah, other mods that I added, I may not have mentioned. I'll do that real quick. I added Backpack, I mentioned that. Um, I added the Iron Chest mod. Um, so we can we can have some some bigger chests here. Uh, there's the more health. There are some heart containers I might find. I did add more swords. You you saw that there with the the lapis swords and the infinity swords. Uh, multi page chest, which is a nice nice chest, does require diamonds. Project bench, of course, uh, and then yet another leather smelting mod, uh, so I can smelt uh, rotten flesh into leather. Oh, and of course, refine relocation for a bit of sorting. Um, but yeah, I was looking for Railcraft, actually. I want to see... There's the steel tools. Actually, can I still make steel tools? Yeah, I can make steel tools. Now, can I make steel? Railcrafting gets steel. Indu There's the industrial blast furnace. And the alloy smelt... Ugh. Okay, this is the Railcraft blast furnace. Okay, so I can still... I can still do it. The blast... The Railcraft last furnace way which I may end up doing but anyway I think we'll, we'll wrap this up here I'll probably end up splitting this into two episodes actually so <laughs> got a little bit long but now I mean we're making progress we can get started um, get started on on the Bronze Age actually I'll probably first things first I'm gonna go get some clay because we are gonna need quite a bit of brick another problem with this water tank is it needs slime and I have not seen slime at all, so I'm not sure how I'm going to rectify that unless I can just make slime. Um, and just for centrifuge, which I don't have. Oh. I'm under a flash flood watch, <laughs> apparently. If you guys heard that. <laughs> Uh, that's the stupid crap. Okay, yeah, can't make slime, so don't know how I'm going to do that. I'll have to figure that out. So anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed. Uh, making progress. Making progress. Still got Black Rock Mountain on Hearthstone going. Uh, need to get that finished up. Shut up, phone. I'm busy. <laughs> anyway, it's been Sarcasm. See you guys next time.